Hello there, I would like to take you through a tutorial on how to use an egg boiler. This is the egg boiler, as you can see, it has a few uh, parts of the hole. Um, that is the cover or the lid, that is the egg tray, as you can see, and then we have uh, the boiler itself, and it has a stainless steel top. It's not as thick it's not as uh, as deep and then we have the source of power so what you do if you want to use the egg boiler so you get to clean your eggs remember to clean your eggs once you buy them I don't know if you do that you can just wipe them uh, remember to clean them and then uh, take the number of eggs that you require to boil and place them on the tray for the sake of this video we will do just two eggs okay and as you can see it holds a total of seven eggs this is the tiny egg boiler maybe there could be other bigger ones so this one holds a total of seven once you place the eggs you now need some water cold water in this case which you pour on to the um egg tray and it goes direct to the stainless steel um surface and as you can see this the the silver uh the silver line uh on top of the boiler that is how deep uh the stainless steel goes so it's not as deep uh it doesn't go all the way down like a cooking pot so this is just a little water and then once you do that you get to cover it up you can wipe your surfaces to make sure that um, you are safe as you're using um, electricity as you can see my egg boiler has a power um, switch a power button you can put it on and put it off depending on when you want to use it but in this case i just put it on um, at the power source and once you put it on you can see that it starts heating the water that is on the tray down there the stainless steel tray and um, there are those two little eyes <laughs> i call them eyes uh, on the lead and those are uh, that place where the moisture gets to um, to escape uh, or to come out of the the heat that is ongoing in the in the um, egg boiler okay so once you peep in you can see that it's boiling already and this is not a minute into it it's like um, three or so minutes and on so it boils and sometimes there are people who use just a little water because they don't like eggs that are overcooked and they call it the sunny side up when it's a fried egg there are others who just uh, fill up the, the 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 stainless steel tray with water because they want the eggs fully cooked okay and as you can see I am using a wooden cooking stick to show you that uh, moisture is indeed coming off of the two little eyes on my lid so you cannot allow ch children you cannot allow children to play uh, with this little machine as it does its work so just make sure it's uh it's clean the, the environment is dry and then um children should not be allowed close to it because you see this is electricity so we have all those hazards um uh well thought of okay so as you can see it keeps boiling the water keeps boiling and uh, that hot moisture is what cooks the eggs literally so you don't have to put your eggs in a cooking pot and then cover them with water. So this moisture is enough to cook your eggs. Um, and as you can see, the advantage is that 
the eggs can be cooking while you're doing other things in the house okay so once it has done boiling uh, the water has dried out inside there it switches itself off um, once the water is drained okay on the tray once the water is drained on the stainless steel tray it just automatically switches itself off and your eggs should be ready at this point so let's uncover that and remember we've already put off the uh, power from the source so look at those clean dry eggs over there so what I do myself I use the lead um, to just uh, I put in the eggs in the lead and then the next thing I do once I, I put the eggs in the lead I run cold water on the eggs to just uh, cool them okay so once you are done boiling and the water has drained and the machine has switched off automatically remember uh, maybe you could be taking a shower you could be doing other things so the eggs are safe uh, in there but now that we're here we just get to, to um, uh, wash them uh, it's just cooling them actually with some cold water and as you can see I can be able to hold them and then uh, let's see whether the egg has cooked let's see how that goes as you can see uh, it's easy to peel them because they are already cooked so that's how good this little um, egg boiler is as you can see the eggs are cooked okay so that is how you get to use the egg boiler and now the next thing is to consume your eggs and they're ready here are some benefits of eating hard-boiled eggs for breakfast thanks for watching